I chose a wagon over a sedan, especially when it comes to the Subarus, why I prefer having this over the sedan version. Um, usually a big answer for why people choose a wagon over a sedan is obviously more room. And in some cases, yeah, I kind of like the idea of having more room. But I also like the body lines on the wagon a little bit more than the sedan. Now that's kind of funny. I like the roof line a little bit more and I like just the way it looks. Now my wagon in particular has sedan front fenders, sedan rear quarters, and a bunch of sedan parts. I have an 05 STI front end on it, uh, 05 STI interior. 06 STI Brembo's, 04 JDM engine and drivetrain, etc. etc. I'm also running on Tyne fully adjustable coilovers, which makes my ride fairly stiff versus what you would normally see out of the wagon. Um, now, with all that said, I made the wagon particularly to look how I really wanted the wagon to look. I really love the accent of having the sedan body on it because it just makes it look that much more aggressive. And also the nice thing about owning a wagon is you don't get as much unwanted attention as you do on the sedan, especially when you have the big old wing on it or anything. People, you know, kind of don't think anything of it. Now, my wagon's not fast by any means. It's got a little bit of a get up and go, but it's generally still running fairly low boost. Um, it's quite loud. Um, but I really tried to emphasize handling, braking, and looks before I really got into the motor because, I mean, my wagon only has 70,000 miles on it. And that's engine and drivetrain actually have 60,000 miles on it or less if I can remember correctly it might be 58,000 um, so I really wanted to focus on handling braking all that before I got into working on the engine per se now I also well, the compliments you get about a nicely modified wagon versus a stand, you can do a little bit more to a wagon to make it look different than you can do with the stand because usually something that's been done to the sedan has been done to more than one. Now, there's very few sedan bodies, full sedan swapped WRX wagons drive around. There's a couple. They're becoming a little bit more common now because people are, you know, getting more comfortable cutting up their rear quarters. That's usually what scares most people away. They don't want to hack up the body on their car. Now, me in particular, I'm actually looking to add flares on top of my sedan body because I want that little extra, again, extra wideness before I once again go into the motor. Um, plus it just once again it adds that little bit of unique look to it because not only is there very few sedan swapped WRX wagons drive around, there's even fewer sedan swapped WRX wagons with players driving around which once again just puts you that step above the looks department. Now I know a lot of people are you know all performance first then body handling next. Well, I have been working on getting this thing looking right for years now. I've been screwed over twice now. I've had parts stolen off it, body work really messed up. So once again, the body is not where I would like to have it. But it's all fixable and hopefully by the end of next winter I'll have all my little issues fixed and I can Other than that, I just really like the looks and the 
compliments you get driving down the road in a wagon that's done right. And um, if there's anything else you want to know about my wagon in particular, uh, please leave a comment on this video and I'll try to cover it in another one. Um, if you want me to do more driving videos like these, maybe I can do reviews on my friend's cars. Until next time, guys.